y'all coming in today to do a bit of a twofer layout. I am playing with this bonus bundles for May 2022 from Shimmers Paints. I've got gorgeous sequins. I have got Orchid Straw, which is a Shimmers, which is a really, really pretty um, liquid paint. You don't have to add anything to it. I'll be using the this photo of my daughter who created yet another cake, along with this Build-A-Page page kit featuring Maggie Holmes goodies. But I did start with my bonus bundles as my kickoff. I went from that orchid straw color and looked for a collection that had that color in it. And I was like, oh my goodness, Maggie Holmes collection did have tones of it in there. So I thought I would go ahead and use that, um, the shimmers paint to do a really nice amount of splatty bits with that color. So I kind of like this layout design I've come up with. I created some shakers, shaker pockets with the sequins that were part of the bonus bundle. And I went ahead and filled in those frames with those great sequins. And now I'm gonna go in and do the splatty bits around these clusters now that I know where the clusters are going to be. I had to kind of figure that out. Then I'm gonna go ahead and use these die cuts, ephemera, whatever you wanna call them, to fill in spaces around my photo cluster. So I have that going. Oh, and I'm gonna use this title um, sweet right here and I'm going to call it this layout sweet things. I'm not going to do anything momentous with these shimmers. I have my shimmers paints. I added just a little bit of water with them and I'm just uh, creating splatty bits along that column where those um, shaker pockets will be and then all around the area concentrating although it looks like I just put them everywhere which I probably do. Uh, around where my photo clusters are going to be. I don't worry too much about the area where the photo is going to be on top of. I just wanted heavy splatties around it. Okay, so I am getting these pieces on. I'm popping up um, the photo clusters as well as, well, the main photo as well as these little guys. I'm popping them up on just a little bit of adhesive and then tucking the ends under. I mean, I have all these Frankenstein bits of foam, so it actually does work really nicely. So that will be the setup for this. I'm just gonna take a second to faff around and line everything up. So we have the base down. I did go ahead and put the word sweet things underneath, and I cut this vellum flower in half so I could build it out for both sides of my uh, photo cluster. and. I think it's very nice. I like that bit of gold. I have gold on the left, so I do wanna repeat it again on the right. Now I'm just going through and seeing what might look appropriate. I don't know, it never really matters. Just put whatever you like on and it's gonna be beautiful. I mean, it's Maggie Holmes. How could it not end up looking beautiful, right? So let's see. I'm seeing these little banner pieces. I rather dig them. So I'm gonna put one on the top and I'm also gonna end up putting another one below sweet things. I like repeating elements, it's a thing. Oh, and when I saw this, this gorgeous pink flower, I was like, oh, it's kind of like the strawberries on top of the cake. So I don't know. The way the mind works, it's a murky, murky thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this one down below, but I will at the end end up putting it up on a little dimensional adhesive. It looked like it needed just a little bit of a zhuzh. So looking at these stickers that I have, and I decide to include one little critter on each of my sequin clusters, I have a little uh, detail cutout piece of, or like little cake stand, and then I'll go ahead and put little critters on each of them as well. I also tucked in little black and white floral bits and these little black stars. That one has a gold star in the middle and I decided, all right, let me use up, I'm sorry, not stars, hearts. Let me use up these cute little black hearts. So I do have them sprinkled here and there, and I think they're so cute. I looked at using that black and white floral, but it didn't make the cut. Like I have this whole Maggie Holmes sticker book and it's barely been touched. What am I thinking? So yeah, just looking for little elements that will add it always adds, like if you use those little bits, those little confetti sprinkle bits, it adds to your layout and it makes it so much more interesting. 
So here is a little bit more of a close-up of my layout bits. I've got lots of nice texture and dimension and cute things on here. I like my little sequin clusters. The bonus bundle worked perfectly with this collection, which I think is super, super fun. And is there anything else to tell you? Now, I did use up all of my sequins, but I have plenty more of my Orchestra Shimmers paint. Oh, and down below, I will um, have links. Remember to put my name in the comments when you order goodies at the Shimmers site because you'll get a little freebie with your order. And I think that is like the bomb to get a little freebie when you're ordering pretty stuff anyway. Okay, I'll also have links for the Build-A-Page ladies down below. And I will thank you so much for watching. Bye, friends.